This is a digital flashcard tool I created using VBA and Excel, and it can be used for a variety of purposes, in particular studying. You can see that there's two sheets here, and if you go to the definition list, you'll see all the information you would ever need for a flashcard is present, including the word and the definition. As long as it fits this format and can be written as text, you can really put anything here, uh, be it scientific terminology you're studying, or maybe you're trying to learn a new language, so it could be uh, the translations of different words. Uh, but overall, right now, I just have some basic C++ code, uh, Arduino code that I had from some old notes. Um, but really, it can be replaced with anything, and you can click the clear definition list to clear it and add whatever you'd like. Going to the flashcard application itself, you're going to want to start by clicking the start or reset button. Uh, this button will make sure that you're not skipping any words and that you're not going to uh, miss out any new words you may have added since the last time you used the application. Uh, of course, to navigate to the next card, you just click the next button. Uh, this will give a random word, and you're also not going to get any repeats as well. So you're not just going to end up studying uh, the order of the words, but you're going to study the words themselves. Now, since there's no repeats, eventually you'll reach the end of the deck of flashcards, if you will. Uh, and from there, you can just click the Start or Reset button to restart um, the application. Now, of course, uh, the application will notify you of that as well, but if you're really using flashcards, you can also test your memory with definitions. So you can click the show definition button uh, if you need to, to see what a word means. Uh, and of course, in C2, it will give you the value uh, of the definition, but it also adds the word that you click to see the definition for to the words to review list. Uh, and this list can be helpful, especially if you're studying, because it can remind you what words you might need to look back at again because you needed to see their definition. Uh, and it will also keep track of the number of times it repeated. As I mentioned before, since you're resetting the deck every time, uh, it will reset the values within the flashcard application itself, but the values in this list will stay. So once you move on to a next definition, and if you need to see the definition again, it will count how many times you've clicked the show definition button. Now, if you just wanted to reset this list as well, because let's say you change entirely what's in the definition list, you can just click the clear words to review button. Of course, there's also some uh, safekeeping um, functionality as well, like error handling. So for example, if I went in and I changed uh, what was on the flashcard itself, there's not going to be a definition for that. So if you click show definition, it will um, let you know and tell you you probably need to reset the flashcards. So thank you. That's the application. I hope you can find it useful. If you check the description box, you'll be able to find a download link if you'd like to use it. Thank you.